talk about putting in the work and how important that is. You live and breathe what you do. Putting in the work. How do you do it? <laughs> Just do it, man. I get, so that's the cliche way to, to say it, right? Just like, stop wasting time doing useless stuff. Like, whatever it is. If it's if you're spending your time going out all the time and you're complaining about you're not getting business in, like, well, stop going out and then, you know, start working on bringing in your business. I, I enjoy what I do, so it allows me to keep doing it and it becomes my my livelihood. It becomes a, a part of me and I, I just love doing it. Everyone wants 1980s General Motors. You know, come in, punch in, you work your eight hours, you get your pension, you get three to four weeks uh, off a year, you get a discount on a vehicle, you get medical, you get dental, guess what, that's done. And the leadership today, they, they want to follow that and that's where that's where it's falling apart. So what brought you into the field that you're in right now? Into, uh, into mortgages? Yes. I didn't get in as a mortgage broker, I got in as a lender. Okay. So started, uh, been building for the last couple of years, renovating and, and, and building for the last you know 10, 15 years. Yeah, yeah. And then uh, when the opportunity came to uh, to lend money, yeah, so I jumped on that, and then eventually got into the yeah, into the right. mortgage side. Yeah, yeah, that's all good. Kind of yeah. yeah, and and then eventually got into the mortgage side. Yeah, right. So uh, it just doors open, man. You had a, a publication company, and you move forward, and you have your mortgaging, and you're moving forward with that. Like you're constantly. You know, expanding. It's not like you just sit and you're like, okay, this yeah. is my job and I do this yeah. for the rest of my life. Yeah. Does that is that something that you planned from the beginning? No. Is this, is no. This doors doors right? open. Doors open. You know that saying when uh, when the student is ready, the teacher will teach. I think the same thing. When I, when I'm ready, another door opens up, and I always look in. And if I want to jump in, I, I jump in. If not, it's, it's not for me. Then I just it's not for me. That's all it is. Just opportunities come, and you know, I'll, I'll take some of them, and other ones I'll let go. Hi, how are you? I'm good, thank you. Gary? Fine, how are you doing? Great, man. Good to see doing you. Well. Finally get to meet the man. Yes. He's our number one uh, residential lender, yeah. South Hall, Los Angeles. Yeah. And he's been with us for about two months, so yeah. now he's going after that market. He's going after that. That's a market we always stayed away from. Yeah, I know, yeah. man. It's just, I, I just competitive. Yeah, way too competitive. One percent of this lead. Yeah. Like, no loyalty, nothing there. I, I just, I, I've stayed away from there. Yeah. It's acres there. He wants to turn it into Yale Town. Yeah. I see that you frequent a lot. Yeah. yeah. The old town Cole Harbor. Oh, nice. Got to strive for greatness, man. Yes. I played hockey growing up. So oh, did you? Kind of, he was kind of my idol. Yeah. And uh, I don't know. I need Montana up, man. Hockey. Having experience of starting different kinds of businesses, how does that, what are the benefits of that moving forward? Excitement for me. I just, I, I love trying out new things and I love the challenge. And, and another thing I look at is the, the income I can, I can generate from there. Or uh, if it's a field that I want to learn more about, that's the way I've, I've done it, but I don't know. for others, go with your, what your heart says. That's that's more important. Go, with, you know, where you want to be. Like for, for for me, where I want to be in five years, and how do I get there? And you know, this is how I get there. So when you started your publication company, did you know that idea at the time? Did you have that someone told you that, or did you have no. a five-year plan? No, you? that five-year plan came in probably about ten years after I started that. I think a lot of people just pro procrastinate. Pro procrastinate and get stuck on scrolling on uh, on Facebook or looking at other videos on YouTube and they're just not you know focus their, their time you know on or in their business they're scared whatever it is whatever they're scared of uh, what do you what do you think what do you think the fear is in people what most people think? I think the fear is success do you think people are afraid of success I think so I think a lot of, a lot of times people are scared of success because they think they're they might have a lot of money and you know people look at them look at them as assholes and stuff so I, I don't know that you know, it's, it's one of the things and then you, you'll see a lot of times where people will sabotage you know they'll they'll get to a certain level and oh shit you know there's I don't I don't like this I don't like the person I've become and they kind of sabotage themselves then do you think that happens just naturally or do you think that yeah. happens if people aren't doing something that they love I, I both sometimes they'll look at uh, uh, for instance they'll, they'll look around their, their their surrounding at that time and they'll 
you know, their their business has got them so much ahead. And then I look back, it's like, oh, I'm I'm leaving my friends behind me, and uh, I don't want to do that. I want to go back and and help them. And you know, here's another thing I learned was, uh, you know, I'm I'm here to serve, not to save, right? So the ones that don't want to, you know, join me in my path, and I'm I'm not I'm not there to save them, right? You know, cut it, move forward, and. Uh, and there's other people in front of you that that I can serve, right? Saving, serving over saving all day long. Okay, guys. Over the last three weeks, we've been spending a lot of time on social media. We've been directing message, direct messaging uh, realtors, brokers, uh, referral partners, uh, builders, and it's actually worked, and it's worked really well. Uh, now we're trying to now we're meeting with these guys so the wrap up for this week is we actually spent a lot of time doing uh meetings i think we spent two full days meeting with these guys and uh, business is starting to come in so over the next few days here we're going to be putting these deals together so we can get funded in the next one to two weeks have a great weekend and i'll see you guys next week catch you later bye